Bedford comes alive for the River Festival, and it certainly is alive today. The crowds are pouring in, there have been lots of events on the river, and everyone's having a great time. Talking here to Carla, your team is Resolution Recruitment. How did you get on? Hopeless. <laughs> Absolutely useless. We nearly capsized twice. We were the worst by far. Have you enjoyed it though? Yeah, yeah it's been brilliant. Yeah. Have you, uh, have you put training into it? Um, loads. <laughs> which, which obviously reflected in us today on the river. <laughs> Well, today we've got some excellent paddlers in the Premier Division. These are top 20 paddlers in Britain. We've got um, Joe Coombs, Andrew Rendell, uh, James Bailey, and local boy Jake Sylvester. Uh, you have, Bedford, you have and, high hopes for them. And Joel Crossland. Yes, certainly the, the K1 paddlers that you'll see here, um, there's every chance that one of these will be in the Olympics in 2012. They're aged between 16 and 19 years old. They'll be senior paddlers when the Olympics comes around and uh, they're training very hard. Some of these guys are training even 13 times a week. Tell me a bit about wakeboarding then. Okay, well wakeboarding is, I guess the closest um, description is like snowboarding. So you're on a board and you're strapped in. Um, but it's also like water skiing, so you're behind a boat. Or in the demo we're behind a jet ski. And uh, what are you doing here today in Bedford then, guys? Well, I'm really here just to admire the kayaking and, you know, just watch that and watch the guys rip it on the, sh on the kayak. No, I'm just kidding. We've been here to wakeboard to a few demos for the crowds and just sort of sh uh, showcase wakeboarding here in the UK and helping Box Sand out and get a bit of publicity for them. Um, Box Sand Park is new to Bedfordshire. We do wakeboarding and water skiing. Um, we have a restaurant on site and a bar called Corner 5. It's great for all ages to come down and give it a go. It's a new sport, it's fantastic fun, and the staff down at Box End are brilliant. So. Who are these guys that we've been talking to then? Okay, these are UK champions. Um, they wakeboard all over the country in big competitions. They've come down to do some demonstrations for Box End today, um, just to show basically you know, what you can do with wakeboarding and how good you can you know, get to, really. What, what are you enjoying about today? Um, it's, uh, the chips, <laughs> very, like, colourful and, um, um, it's, it's actually quite fun and there's loads of stools, different stools, lots to do, yeah, yeah. and it's quite enjoying. Here I'm talking to? Jean. Jean. And Oliver. <laughs> and what are you enjoying about today, Jean? Um, it's just lovely to come and see so many people having fun, um, <laughs> you know, lots of different cultures. Is this what Bedford's about to you nowadays? Yes, I think it is, yes. Uh, very multicultural, which uh, gives a great deal of variety to, to the area. Yeah, yeah. We are waiting all the year that why not it's happening every year. Yeah, brilliant. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's, it's happening. Yeah. Very, very nice weather, very good people and really lots of really colourful nice. things to see and enjoy. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's, a, it's based on a family environment, so, I mean, and the kids enjoy it, well, we hope they enjoy it, because it's the first time we've bought them since, because he was like a year old when we first bought him. And he was, and, and my missus was carrying the other one, so they didn't know. But now, with they're older, we thought we would bring them down here. Okay, thanks. It's the fact that everyone gets together and everyone's having fun, and it's a bit of fun for once. You don't have much fun otherwise. So, okay, super. enjoying your chips? Because <laughs> we had so much fun, I enjoyed being here because I enjoyed the wow. Bedford has got such a lot to offer. The River Festival has been a great success, the weather's held fine, the crowds have turned out, and it's really good to hear people talking up Bedford. This is Judy Oliver, Local News TV.